it in their oh my god this is graphic but <laughs> Hey Kara Loves and welcome back to my channel. So today for self-care, oh, somebody talk to me. But today for self-care, I am going to get some acupuncture. Am I saying it right? Ac acupuncture on my back. Um, update on my back. My back feels 85% better. I'm so happy that I went to do the cupping. If you haven't already, I'll put the link down below. I think you have um, until May 27th or something to book your cupping session. So go and book your cupping session um, and get, um, I think believe you get 10 or 15% off. And not only that, you can do any service that they have. So as you know, I put tapins in my hair and I did it myself. I added more hair and it looks so much fuller. You can see where my head, hair ends, so I'm just gonna blend it in. It actually does not look bad; like it looks really good. Um, I just can't flat iron my hair every day, so the days that I'm not flat ironing my hair, I'm just putting it in like a ponytail, and that works with me. Works for me because you can put, I can put it up into like a high ponytail if you're not following me already. Go follow me on Instagram and TikTok. And you can see updates there on the reel and how I put it in a ponytail. I'm not putting it in a ponytail today. I don't think. I might. Um, depending on what I look like today. Um, but my hair did sweat out yesterday. So I did have to like flat iron it um, today. I don't plan on flat ironing my hair every day. Like that's going to break off the little bit of hair that I have. But, um, I do try to do it at least once a week, even though I just put it in. So, I put it in, like, maybe five days ago. So, in five days, I had to, like, flat iron and just blend it in. And I like the way it blends in so smoothly. Now, when I go outside, the wind does blow, but for the most part, they're very lightweight. I'm just, oh my gosh, I'm in love with these tapings i do want to get them professionally done because i know that i did not do them right in the back so let me just show you guys the back so i know that my parts are probably not straight back there but for the most part i love my hair like i could just throw it back like that and just be good to go but um, like I said, today I'm going to do some acupuncture at this place called Politics Community Acupuncture in Brooklyn. I'm doing a free trial. Well, it's actually not a free trial. It's a paid trial. However, um, it's a paid trial. However, it's like a community-based acupuncture session where they'll do like a con where they'll do like a um, consultation they'll do your acupuncture right there and then you have to fill out these intake forms and you know i'm gonna try to get as much footage as i can and create a reel for you guys um so i'm headed there now just want to give you like this little update on my hair update on my back and um i did put on my moisturizing tint this is not sponsored the lip bar used to sponsor me at this point but i 
genuinely love it so i don't care i i genuinely love this it's the only thing i put on my face these days like before i would sit in for 20 minutes doing my makeup now one two three five boom still have my natural look it doesn't look too crazy but i do love a good beat phase so and i haven't went out in so long I literally am a homebody but i do like to party like i do like to go out i don't go out often but i do like it right so definitely want to take some time the next few weeks to go out and show you guys this is the restaurant that i've been dying to go to so i feel like um in the next few weeks i am going to actually get cute and pretty and go oh gosh look at my hair do you guys see my hair <laughs> can you see that hair sticking out I'm not about to flat iron it because you can't even see it. But anyway, girl, I need to get out of the house because, of course, your girl has to be there in like 45 minutes and it's all the way in Brooklyn. <sighs> so let me get out the house now and I will see you guys in the car. Well, I'll see you when I get there. Hey, Kara loves. So today is a whole nother day. I went all the way downtown and I was so late that they were unable to see me. It did make me a little sad, but it was my fault. I was late. Like, I was more than a little late. Like, I was going to be, like, a whole half an hour late. I'm just putting in a little bit of meal moisturizer just because yesterday I flat ironed it. And like I said, I'm not flat, iron flat ironing my hair every day. I wrapped it last night. Not a full doobie wrap, but, like, I put it, like, down and then I put the scarf over. So it's kind of flat already. Um, I'm probably going to put it in a ponytail, but you see these little flurries that's popping out. I just want to hold it down with some meow because I'm not, I'm not flat ironing my hair every day. Like that's insane and it will definitely break off and y'all already know my hair is already short. But anyway, I'm going to put on some red lips today because I just, I don't know, I like the natural look, but I just want to put some oomph into today. So let me put my lipstick, lipstick on. I'm wearing the lip bar, of course. I, I usually wear YSL, which I have it in, in there. I just want to wear this today. Um, Cause I like how this goes on like creamy and then it, it melts. Um, my YSL is really like creamy. It does get matte, but it's also really creamy. So this is more light. So let me put on these, this lipstick. Um, there we go. So it looks um, like a wet matte right now, but then when it dries, it looks a lot better. I'm also going to do something to my eyelashes so I'm looking in the camera I can't really see what I'm doing but oh, shoot <laughs> yeah I'm, I need to look in the mirror and stop doing it this way because I can't I can barely see but yeah I want to try I know I said I didn't really like um eyelashes which I don't I, I barely wear them but I think I'm gonna try it one more time to see like what the deal is um I'm going to put my hair in a ponytail because I'm going to, so not only did I have to reschedule my appointment for Pilates, Pilates, that's what I meant to say, but not only did I have to reschedule my appointment for the acupuncture, which I'm going to do the acupuncture now, I had to, I mean, I decided to take a Pilates class as well today because your girl is fucking fat. Like I'm, I'm not fat. Like if you see me, you're like, oh, you're not fat, you're not fat. But I feel it. I feel it. I walked up the steps yesterday, could not breathe. Um, <laughs> I, yeah, it's time. And my, you, I don't know if you can tell, like my my neck, my everything feels chunky. And I like the extra weight in certain areas. But like, I need to be physically fit. Like at this point, 
it's not really about vanity it's about having great health so with that being said i do need to start working out so today i am going to be doing a pilates class and acupuncture so i'm going to make this hopefully this could be one vlog um if not if it's too long i'm going to do two two vlogs i know you guys like to see like certain um treatments that i'm doing instead of combining two but i'll let you guys know what i'm doing once i get in the car depending on how long the acupuncture is which you can always follow me on instagram and tiktok will you see um clips of the acupuncture in one reel and then you'll see the pilates in another so let me go throw some earrings on i'll see you guys in the car hey camera loves so good news is that it's sunny outside and that made me really happy um it was we having pretty good weather the last two days i mean at night time it gets really cold but for the most part it hasn't been as bad um i need to stay off of tiktok late at night because can we talk about the Dubai video that I've seen of influencers going to Dubai, Dubai getting shitted in their, oh my god, this is graphic, but they're getting shitted on for money, and they're not shitting on your, first of all, all of that shit is nasty, but you're literally going to Dubai to become a human toilet is insane to me like insane to me to the point where I couldn't sleep I literally had a nightmare about it and I like I didn't think it was funny I didn't think it was cute I didn't think it was something that you know people were reposting it laughing on Twitter like doing on all these sites and just like I get that these women are putting themselves in position to, to do certain nasty shit like that and they're getting paid $100,000, $70,000, but that shit is fucking degrading, demonic, and disgusting. And I I literally felt bad. Like, I, I wanted to throw up the entire night. I don't know who sent me. Who sent me? Who sent me to see that? Who? I, I couldn't believe what my eyes. I'm like pray for them pray for them a lot of the video that i did see though i kind of felt like she was against her will in a way because i don't even want to talk about it no more go see for yourself go to twitter if you want if you want to see this graphic nonsense if you want to be like me <laughs> and you want to have nightmares go to twitter and type in human porta potty you're going to be in it's going to ruin your day so if you don't want your day ruined don't do it but if you're a curious fucking george like me go do it like i don't understand why i went to go even google it like i just kept seeing people on tiktok talk about it but they weren't saying exactly what it was and oh my god i cannot believe that like I don't even like I wanted to visit Dubai as a vacation I don't even want to go like I don't ew like I don't even want to go anymore like that's so disgusting obviously people go out there to travel and stuff but the women who are going out there to become a human porta party for a hundred thousand dollars is freaking insane it's demonic it's it's dangerous it's just it's somebody's feces on you like what Anyway, that's, this is my car rent for today. I need to pay attention to the road. I'm going, the first stop is going to be Wellington. Um, it's called Wellington um, Wellness and Acupuncture. I'll put it on the screen. You guys know when I get there, I'm put it on the screen. But I'm going to get acupuncture, some cupping, and a light massage. So I'm going to go do that today. And then I'm going to go do Pilates. I should have done that the opposite i should have went to pilates first and then did the wellington thing however um that's just what my availability is set up for today so this may be a two-part vlog or this may be a separate vlog each of me doing pilates today oh i can't get by and they upset with me the car is behind me but i can't see hold on guys 
you would think I would be like a more of a aggressive driver because I've been driving for so long but honestly like uh -uh. I'd rather you just go if you're in a rush like uh because I hate being out of commission with a car like because people will dead ass with their funky cars ugly cars they will they will crash into you on purpose <laughs> so yeah no I'm good but yeah so basically so today I'm going to do acupuncture and then I'm going to do Pilates it may be a two part vlog it may be separate vlogs I don't know but um, depending on how long it is it's already super long because you as you can see in the beginning of the vlog there was um, me doing like a, a light facial and then um acupuncture appointment guess what happened there is a um what do you call that a marathon in downtown brooklyn in like the downtown area of brooklyn and brown greenpoint and they have so many closures so all the streets are blocked off it's tons of traffic the bridge is like 20 minute delays and I am pissed because yesterday I missed my occupancy appointment. I made a complete new one and now today I missed it. So that is the, that is my guides telling me that acupuncture is not in the plan <laughs> this weekend. So I'm going to, um, I just got to Pilates. I'm going to a place called, let me tell you guys where I'm going right now. Pilates Brooklyn is in Greenpoint, Brooklyn. Brooklyn. I'm going to post the name once I get in there. Um, definitely needs to work out. Definitely needs to stretch. Definitely needs to exercise. Hopefully this can help with like me just being, feeling stiff. Like I just want to be more flexible. I used to take in the past these classes called bar classes and it's like um, ballet but it's bar and it also stress, stress, stretches you out. So I want to start doing that before I start like getting to some like heavy intense workout because when I went to that drip set, drip sweat class maybe a few weeks ago, I literally was down for like a week and a half, almost two weeks. Like my body was just like that was too much for a beginner's workout. So this week I am going to incorporate more exercise, which is going to be like classes, which are not high intensity. Now, Pilates, I've been hearing that it is high intensity, but at the same time, it stretches your body out, which I need. I need to be stretched out like completely. Um, so I'm an hour early because I was supposed to do the acupuncture. So I'm going to just see what they have around this neighborhood. Maybe I can go get like a green juice or... I don't see anything appealing right now. I do see like a green natural market right here, which is like a supermarket that has like fruits and veggies. I don't think they have a juice bar, but um, if not, then I'm just going to just go to Pilates and then take myself back home because this has been a frustrating afternoon trying to get through traffic. All these places are blocked off. They have people running, they have people on bikes, and I should have watch the news i never watch the news so yeah <laughs> anyway um i will see you guys when i get inside of pilates Until my will runs dry, when I ascend, I only pay the 
Audio Jungle.